Thank you very much, Chairman Menendez, Ranking Member Risch, and members of the Senate Foreign Relations Committee. Thank you for allowing me to briefly introduce Dr. Amy Gutman and express my strong support for her nomination to be our next U.S. Ambassador to Germany. Dr. Gutman, thank you for your willingness to serve in such an important leadership role. As members of this committee likely know, Dr. Gutman currently serves as the president of the University of Pennsylvania. And before I highlight just a few of her many accomplishments there, I want to acknowledge a different aspect of Penn's history, which I think is relevant to this hearing. Penn's founder, Benjamin Franklin, was one of the U.S. most accomplished diplomats. He skillfully nav nav navigated the complicated dynamics of 18th century European politics to promote American ideals and protect our nascent democracy abroad. Of course, much has changed since then, but some of the diplomatic challenges that Franklin faced remain the same today, including faithfully and ardently defending U.S. interests, even in times of disagreement with our allies while maintaining close relationships. We face this challenge today in our relationship with one of our most important European allies, Germany. We rely on Germany as a major security and trade partner, especially given its role in the European Union. And amidst increasing global threats to the U.S. and Europe, strong U.S. representation to Germany, to Germany is critical. I am confident that Dr. Gutman will rise to meet these and other challenges facing the U.S. and our European allies. Dr. Gutman earned bachelor's and doctorate degrees from Harvard University, a master's degree from London School of Economics, she subsequently spent over 20 years at Princeton University in a myriad of roles, most recently as university provost. In 2004, Dr. Gutman became the eighth president of Penn, a position she still holds today. And during her tenure, she dramatically grew Penn's endowment, expanded Penn's commitment to science, technology, and medical innovation, and enhanced the university's engagement in the Philadelphia community, among other things. Dr. Gutman is a widely respected expert in subjects ranging from ethics to healthcare to political philosophy. And she's received countless awards and honors, including being named to Fortune's World's 50 Greatest Leaders list in 2018. Her impact at Penn has been recognized, including by the many Penn students who regard her as a committed and passionate leader. These accomplishments, coupled with her commitment to global leadership and experience in academia and the highest levels, have prepared Dr. Gutman well for the role of UN Ambassador. As I conclude, I also want to note the significance of Dr. Gutman's nomination in the context of her family's history. Her father fled religious persecution in Nazi Germany in the 1930s, and her family's return to Germany in the form of U.S. Ambassador Amy Gutman will be an extraordinary moment. I am confident Dr. Gutman will approach this next mission with the same ingenuity, tenacity, and dedication as she did over the nearly 20 years she has spent at Penn, and I look forward to supporting Dr. Gutman's nomination, and I urge my colleagues to do the same. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Thank you.